Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Dean Challenges You. Right now I'm on my way to Washington Square Park. I'm gonna meet up with Dominic Leonelli. Today we're gonna have a rap battle. Yo, what's up y'all? It's Dominic Leonelli right here. The duck man, get a shot of them boots. Yeah, get a shot at them, because it's about to get wet out here. Dean David came up to me, you know, trying to ask me, what do I want to do? What do, who do I want to challenge him to? So I said, rap battle. I know this motherfucker can't fight. So I said, I'm going to rap him. I've been waiting for this shit all week. I've been studying Dominic Leonelli. I've been looking at rap battles every single day. I've been writing down my notes right here. I've been doing everything I can because I'm hungry for a win right now. You understand? I've only won one in five. My record's not great. What do you got? Something I want. So I'm about to go. I'm about to go challenge Dominic Leonelli to a rap battle. You think? No, no yes. way. You think I have what it takes to be a rapper? No, definitely not. You barely got what it takes to be a comedian. So I'm trying not to drink Coca-Cola for one year straight. It's been about five days, and it's getting really freaking hard. So I'm drinking Sprite now. This is like the new thing for Dean Challenges You, is if I can accomplish to not drink any more Coke. I just want to live and have a good time. Dominic Leonelli's gonna be here any minute. And when he gets here, you better believe I got some rapid yeah. shit going. Yo, there he goes. You about to get work. Yo, what's up, man? What's up, man? Yeah, I got the tool bag for you. you got the tool bag? Huh? I got them hammers out here, baby. Huh? <laughs> All right, well then, yeah, I'm about to get work. We'll see what happens. We're about to gather some people right now and let them be the judge. One, two, you got that, right? Sounds good. One, two, Mike, Mike. One, two, hello, hello. Okay, wait, hold on, let me, it was off. It was off, there it is, the mic was off. All right, we're gonna get started here. What you're gonna see is two comedians rap battling each other. Maybe this will open Look at him, man. What else can he do? He can't do nothing else. Maybe play some stickball or something. So give it up for my homie. He's going no beat. Yo, welcome to the show. Dean challenges you. This is the only comedy show that you'll ever get to do. I see you on stage. When you leave, people applauding and screaming. But bro, that's not because you're funny. They're applauding because you're leaving. Let's see what you got. This dude's name's Dean David. His name's more backwards than a Sheem Shaman. Man, he ain't even man enough to quit shaving. Look at my boots, LL Bean, I'm the duck man. <laughs> you better duck, man. <laughs> you skinny as fuck, man. You about to catch a hot hand. Your breath smell like salmon in a pan. Man, I heard your asshole's more beat than chip chop ham. Man, <laughs> I killed Kenny. You more hick than cow. Kenny, Stan, <laughs> don't come on down to my South Park. There ain't no friendly faces. You about to just catch them laces. Ow. You didn't deserve the mic drop on that. <laughs> I got you, ready? No lie, bro, I think you're mad funny. One day, I think you'll be a big star with mad money. So don't stress it, bro. Your time will come soon. So guys, give it up for the biggest star of 3002. Hold up, I didn't want to have to do this to him, man. I didn't want to have to do it to him. Hold on, man. All right, here we go. Big Popeye forearms, I'll pull your hair back, make it look like olive oil. I don't got a moral, your only moral is oral. Man, I heard comedy bookers say your mouth is wetter than coral. You looking like a broke Seinfeld, I'll take your Elaine. Better go get Costanza, your man's up behind the cameras, about to throw his hands up. Tony ain't seen fire like this since the nine blown. Shh, you just got your mind blown. Man, get the fuck up out of here and go home. <laughs> All right, yo, damn dude, the bars were sick. I can't help but feel like you're compensating for that Tootsie Roll dick. Oh! All right, enough with the shit about your career. That shit's getting hacky. So let me hear some other shit you got to say about me. Here we go. Tight ass jeans, some little kid jeans. Man, I heard you like sitting on orange street cones with an Obama phone. You out of minutes, man, I'm the wittest. I heard you have been turning over saying, hey boys, come get this. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh, that deserved more. That wasn't bad. That deserved more. I give you that. <laughs> How many people for me? Hey, man. Oh, we got, got a clap, dude. You got tried cheating on my ass. It's no surprise. It's unbelievable. I worked really hard on my raps. <laughs> I wrote that shit on the train over here. <laughs> 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 
What's up? We just wrapped up. It was fun. Uh, everybody loved it, man. We were at West Point. We had a little group of people and we rap out and man, Dean, he came with some heat. You know, Dean surprised me. I gotta be honest with you. I worked really hard on my raps. You know, I wrote them. I thought they were very clever. I thought some lines were not, you know, they didn't get the love that they deserved. And here, here man, you're gonna have to I'm gonna give these to Dean so he could fix his heart after that L he just caught. There you go. It's a little heavy for you. Yeah, no, a little heavy fun. for you. Thanks for having me on, y'all. I don't know how I lost. Can I, can I do a thing now? I was underrated, I felt like. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching Dean Challenges You. This has been another great episode. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel below. And please remember to follow me on Instagram right here. Right here. This little thing. Dean David 95.